Okay, we're going to go ahead and install HTT Probe in this video. And before we do that, we're going to install the Go language, which I've actually already typed in here. You've seen this a few times now. sudo apt get install go lang. You will hit enter. You will be prompted to enter your password. Uh, I wasn't because I just installed this to make sure that uh, we didn't have to wait because it takes several minutes to install and you might be prompted. Uh, are you sure you want to install it? You'll hit Y and then hit enter. And then once you have this installed, I want us to go ahead and hit LS and we are going to make a new directory for our tools directory for tools that we will be installing. I also like to put my word lists in there as well. And so we're going to make make directory and I'm just going to go ahead and call mine tools and then I'll hit enter. You can hit LS and then here is our new directory. So we're going to change directories and we're going to move into tools. And then you can see it is added here and it should be empty, which it is. Now we're going to come over here to our GitHub, but before we get there, I'll show you how we got to this page. So we're going to go HTT probe. It'll be the first one. We will click on it. Um, we're going to click the green button here and we are going to, you can click this and it should uh, copy for us um, what we need to clone this if I can you can or you can highlight it I'm struggling so I'm gonna go ahead and not highlight it and just click the clipboard which should copy it and since we're in our tools this is where it's going to uh, put the file for us and we're going to type in git clone and then we're going to paste what we just copied and we'll hit return and this will clone the file for us we should be able to hit ls and see we now have the directory uh, inside of tools so we will change directory into http probe and then we'll hit ls again actually we'll clear this so we're at the top we'll hit ls again and we're going to see this main.go this is going to um, build it for us so that's executable and we're going to go ahead and type in go build go build main dot go and now we should have an executable we're going to change the name from main to HTT probe and we're going to go ahead and type in um, mv main HTT probe and hit I had too many V's come in here just one V and then we'll LS and you can see our name has been changed, but we don't want to come into this folder every time we want to run HTT probe. And so we're going to go ahead and move it to our bin folder. And if you want to see where we're moving it to, we're going to move it to uh, our, we can echo the path and we're gonna put it in this bin folder here. And so we're going to move the executable and then we hit go ahead and we don't have permission. Do you see this right here? That means we need to add sudo help. I actually didn't make it all the way. And then this will tell us so we can now run the file. Um, and just to make sure we can run it from anywhere, you can CD and it'll take us back to our home and you can run dash dash help and it ran. 